Mr. Vaughn Fry. All right, so this story is called The First Time a SWAT Team Descended Upon Me at a Movie Theater. See if you can tell where this is going. So, a few years ago, I was a movie critic, and I had these uh, tickets for advanced screening of The Amazing Spider-Man, and this was in Derby, small theater, Spider-Man, not a whole lot else to do around town, free tickets. It's gonna be pretty crowded, so I show up about an hour and a half early, and I'm looking for a good seat, and I find a good seat in the middle, and next to me are two girls, and they're young, and then um, I thought, hey, this would be a great time to do a case study. See if it's really that important to have a Spider-Man reboot already. It only been 10 years. Uh, did they know of Tobey Maguire? I mean, like, who doesn't already know Spider-Man's origin story? I mean, you guys can say it with me. Peter Parker is from the planet Krypton. <laughs> so I'm talking to him. Hey, you know about the Spider-Man? Yeah, they know about it, and you know that's all good. And they got up and left. There was like musical chairs going on in the theater. Nobody wants to sit behind Shaq, right? So this is going down. An hour into the movie, uh, Spider-Man is fighting the lizard on the bridge. And I get a tap on my shoulder. And I hear, uh, you need to come outside now. And I'm like, OK, uh, let's see what this is about. Uh, and I was kind of hopeful, actually, because this was actually on July 3rd, 2012. This was one day before a segment I shot for Tosh.0 was going to air, and I thought, oh, maybe they weren't talking about that. Maybe it worked that out. So I'm walking over to uh, the hallway thinking, okay, this kind of waited, I guess. And that's when I see the SWAT team. And one of the cops says, so uh, there's a complaint that you're trying to abduct two young girls. And I was like, you know, a little caught off guard about that. And I could have said, hey, I'm a movie critic, here's the magazine I write for, here's the website. I just want to know if it was really that necessary to retell Spider-Man's origin story. That's all, officer. But I didn't say that, no. I, I said, uh, have you seen Fight Club? And I, mean, like, I don't talk to cops on a regular basis. I, I don't, I'm white. Uh, how am I supposed to know you're not supposed to say stuff like that? So, uh, yeah, I'm not a movie critic now, and uh, I can't go within 100 yards of a school. So, show of hands, who's really excited about dying? Oh, okay, I thought this was a, like, open-minded crowd, you know, death, don't knock it till you try it, right? So, I'd like to think about how I'm going to get murdered, and I, I kind of assume it's going to be by cyborgs from the future sent back in time to take me out, because I'm going to be much more important later in life. Of course, uh, but I just kind of hope it doesn't happen yet. I've got a few things to check off on my bucket list. Uh, primarily, I gotta wipe my hard drive of child porn. Hey, follow me on Twitter, on Fry. Thank you.